Local officials are cracking down on shoplifting this weekend. Portland police officers and Multnomah County deputies are collaborating on retail theft missions during this holiday season. Welcome to Coin 6 News. I'm Elise Haas. Police tell us that theft is always more common towards the end of the year. So Joyce O'Geary joins us with some of the results of the weekend's operations. These missions are nothing new. The joint retail theft missions have been around for years. So far, they have made two dozen arrests, recovered two stolen cars, and more than $3,500 worth of stolen goods. The police are here to help. The police are here to, to stop criminal activity. That's the message from Sergeant Craig Anderson, who's part of the retail theft mission at Mall 205 and Gateway. The Portland Police East and Central Precincts teamed up with Multnomah County Sheriff's Office. We see stolen cars, guns, drugs, and that's just a general interaction while our community is here trying to shop and get their groceries and get their items for the holidays. The goal is to make the community feel safe and reduce crime. Police say shoplifting and other criminal data drives the decisions about which stores and shopping centers to focus on during the mission. Theft suspects will get go into the store and they'll be in there for hours. We spoke to someone who was busted but wasn't taken into custody. I ended up taking three items that I felt I needed really badly. I've been sick, kind of ashamed. I don't know. Embarrassed. I'm just tired. I've been coughing all last night and didn't get much sleep. So I think it was just stress. It caused me not to think uh, think well because I, I didn't really need to take those items. Sergeant Anderson says cases like this one, it's about more than the arrest. We can give them a citation in, lieu in custody. So so we we use our discretion and help those people when, when we think it's a, just a situation where they need more help, a little more care. And, and get them and keep them on, on a, a good path. We'll get the results of today's mission later this week and Portland police say more operations are on the way. Reporting in Portland, Joyce O'Geary, Coin 6 News.